to my channel long time no see i know i know right well actually you guys have seen me every week so for me it's long time because i haven't been filming any videos for the past few weeks and um it feels good to be back and filming so um if you haven't seen the tutorial on this hair right here it's going to be up here um click on that and that will take you straight there or you can wait after watching this video and then you can go back and um watch the hair toots so just to get started, I'm going to just quickly do my my usual foundation routine and all of that stuff. We're going to get straight into the eyes because that's pretty much the look I'm going to be focusing on in this video. So um, I'm not going to talk too much at this point. So I'm just going to get straight in. Um, I'm going to just show you guys the products I'll be using. If not, I'm going to just leave everything down below because you guys know my usual products that I've been using. I mean, and if you've been watching my previous, my recent videos um, on my makeup, um toot you guys will know what products that i will be using in this video anyways if that makes sense so that's that so let's just get straight in and let's not waste too much time you know what i'm trying to say but before we do i'm just going to just quickly moisturize my face with a nivea um uh, lotion because i haven't done that yet um so i make sure my face is nice and hydrated before getting straight into the whole foundation i don't have vaseline i'm just going to put a bit of that on my lips as well and um yeah so let's get straight in i'm applying um primer onto my skin i'm gonna pretty much apply this everywhere you guys know already um so that's that whilst i let it set for a bit i'm actually going to just go in with a setting spray i'm just gonna spray it spray it lightly um so i'm gonna pump at least maybe spray at least two or three times Let that sit for a bit. Whilst I'm waiting for it to sit, I'm just gonna quickly do my brows. White gold sitting on my necklace. Uh, fuck shit up, then I exit. exit. Yeah, yeah. You want to test this? See, man, I break your block down like Tetris. Uh, shut down when I step in. Everything cool till the yellow one check it. Check this. going for like a smoky dark look i haven't done a smoky in ages man um so i'm gonna do just that to get started i'm going to be just quickly showing you this um palette right here this is an nua mea makeup academy um eyeshadow palette this is perfect for like if you're just starting you're a beginner you don't exactly you're not exactly used to um doing um, eyeshadows or you want to start with something nude because not everyone is into a dramatic um, eye look um, so you want to just start something simple this guys is perfect it may be little it may just have six shades but believe me you need this like if you are trying to start off by just you know trying something a little bit more on a natural nude side definitely go for this I got this from super drugs by the way and um, I'm going to actually start off with that and then we'll kind of want to see how it goes so i'm gonna start off with this brown shade i like to use this brown shade i don't know if it's clear because of the lighting okay so um this is the shade right here can you now see it clearly i had to kind of dim the light a little because it was making it look a little bit too like pale so i'm going to use this shade right here this one right here i'm going to use this shade and i am just going to just apply that just above my crease um just to create an, a transitioning shade as you guys know already um so i just apply it just above the crease area because it's more of a natural shade and it kind of blend it's kind of like closer to my um my my skin kind of shade it's just a perfect way to start off in like creating a transitioning shade basically just find a color that suits your skin don't go for something that's gonna look weird on your skin just start off with something that you feel like uh, will be a best transitioning shade for you um and yeah that's that so i'm just gonna start off with this shade 
and I'm just going to kind of blend this inwards. You can't really see much, so it's not really do much difference, but this is just a good way to set my eyelids as well, so my eyelids doesn't does crease after a while. Okay, so I'm going to be using a Revolution palette now. This one right here, you guys can see the shades. I'm actually going to quickly do my, my just um, highlight my brow, my brow bow, because um, sometimes I do tend to forget to do that. So I'm going to just quickly do that first. This one right here. If you guys can see it. keeps focusing on me, like stop focusing on me, focus on this, okay? So this is it, yeah? Use it lightly, not too much, because this is very pigmented, guys, so just bear that in mind. Now, usually when I'm going to work, I don't like to wear too much makeup, but um, I guess today's just one of those days, isn't it? I'm going to go for this shade right here. And um, we're just going to kind of pack this just on the outer corner and then working our way in. I'm on a roll, my brother. Uh, let's go, other go, oh my brother. Uh, Nobody today, we getting dough, my brother. Uh, they say the money don't flow like water. Yeah, yeah. Everything cool and proper. Uh, to make it I'm going to use a bit of a shimmery look, a shimmery um, shade. Um, so I'm going to see if I can find another brush. But no, I'm actually going to use my hands. I'm actually going to use this shade here. I'm just going to lightly apply this just on the inner part of my eyelids this is very pigmented like I said so just keep that in mind I like to use my fingers because I feel like it's able to, it helps um, the eyeshadow melt well onto my skin my cup up, I'm with you to never grab a girl and lock up. When I come true, man, I lock up, lock up. Hey, check this. Everybody see I move right. So I'm gonna just go back and just kind of blend everything. And I'm using that same brown shade that I used to do the transitioning shade. So that's that. You can pretty much leave it like this. Um, and you could do an eyeliner, put mascara, put false lashes or whatnot. It's really up to you. I'm actually going to go a little bit darker. Like I said, I'm trying to achieve a smoky eye look. Um, so I want to go a little bit deeper. So I'm going to use the black right here, which is the only black shade. And um, I'm just going to use a different brush now. I'm going to use one of my favorite blending brushes I'm gonna just tap just a tiny bit because I don't want it to be too smoky because like I said I'm going to work I'm not I'm not going to wedding so I'm gonna try and just tap just a tiny bit on the corner of my eyelids on the outer V and I'm gonna gently work my way in so I'm gonna show you from this side so you guys can see well so I'm just lightly tapping it like this and you can pack on as much as you want guys you can pack on as much as you want if you feel like it's too light for you keep on packing until you achieve the um the look that you're going for so i'm just gonna keep on packing until i feel like it's enough and i'm just gonna go gently blend inwards so i'm just gonna keep on packing at this point i'm not gonna blend i'm not gonna sweep I'm not going to swoop it, I'm just going to keep on tapping. I'm going to say use the same brown shade here. I'm just going to just help. I'm just going to just blend the black inwards. So this is just to turn that, turn the black, the black a little bit. If you feel like the black is too much, just packing that brown over it will just kind of turn it down a little so it will just look a little bit more, you know. Um, natural to you if that makes sense so I'm just going to just kind of blend this in finito so that is done so um you don't have to do a wing liner for this you can actually go like this and you are good to go you know me I love me some wing so I'm gonna create a wing um, to it so I'm using my usual what's this this is a Remo Land London um, glam eye I'm just going to just quickly create a wing and I'll, I'll be good to go. You want test this? See, man, I break your block down like Tetris. Uh, shut down when I step in. Everything cool till a girl and one check it. Check this. Get a 
come through with a bathing suit. Man, a bad man, man, a crazy youth. Galilee. I'm gonna use my L'Oreal foundation. I'm also gonna use my concealer and also gonna use the foundation sticks to do my highlighting and contour and all that good stuff. When I say we should knock off the thing or the goons on deck. Got a nigga wondering who's up next. Fresh from my head to my shoes and crepes. When the beat drop, one, two, and step, step. Check this. Everybody see I move reckless. White coat sitting on my necklace. Ah, uh, fuck shit up, then I exit. Yeah, yeah. You want to test this? See, man, I break your block down like Tetris. Uh, shut down when I step in. Everything cool till I yell and one check it. Check this. set this onto my skin but I'm not gonna pack too much to it because I don't want it to be too much to my skin so I'm just gonna pack it sometimes when you put too much um, setting spray also I mean setting powder depending on the setting powder that you're using it tends to just leave a, a patch and tends to leave your face looking all white and ashy and you know for a while now I've been doing this technique and um, it's just kind of gotten to a point where I'm kind of done with that now so I'm just gonna just lightly set that onto my skin I'm not gonna do too much at the end of the day so I'm just gonna just lightly set it and at the same time just kind of blending it into my skin uh, rather than just leaving it there if that makes sense I'm going to just use a black pencil just um, apply down to my lower waterline a l'oreal powder just to set my face overall and then that'll be it i'm now going to use this revolution palette and i'm going to use this shade mixed a bit with this just to brighten it up a little shut up my friend don't mind that my sister in the background taking the piss as usual. Um, like I said, I'm gonna show, I'm gonna use both these shades and then I'm going to just lightly highlight my skin. And this is in shade mahogany. Um, so I'm going to start off by applying this looks like this by the way guys and um it's a nice shade mink lipstick this in shade mulberry i'm going to outline my lips that is all guys so last thing is the uh, setting spray I'm gonna set everything and we will be done Everybody see I move reckless White coat sitting on my necklace Ah, uh, fuck shit up, then I exit Yeah, yeah, you want to test this See man, I break your block down like that. So this is the final result Hope you guys enjoyed this video Um, this is perfect for for No, oh, I can't even speak English This is perfect for beginners Um, whether you are just about starting And you want to try it out Or you're not so sure Like, this is like a perfect video for you Everything that I've showed um, I feel like it's a great way to start in applying um, eyeshadow and all of that good stuff. So, yeah, that's that, and everything will be left down below. 
hopefully so yeah that's pretty much it hopefully you guys enjoyed give me a thumbs up share comment and subscribe share to your friends family share it to the world and if you haven't seen a video on this hair right here it will be uh, i'll leave a link up there so you guys can just click on that and it will direct you straight on to the video and then you guys will get to see how i achieve this you know look right here so um that's pretty much it so i hope you guys enjoy don't forget to follow me on instagram as well you guys take care stay blessed and i shall see you guys in my next video bye